happy to speak on the important motion this evening. It is appalling to note that there were 3,568 children awaiting a first assessment of needs nationally at the end of March, and that there were over 850 children with special uh, educational needs receiving home tuition while awaiting school placement. This is shocking, Minister. And I know you're not the Minister for, for, for Health, but this is a, a, a usual thing now. It's our topic as well, you were taking them. They have run and scared and won't answer the questions. It's a shocking disgrace that we can't look after the most vulnerable children and the most special of needs people. And I salute the SNAs and the work they try, try to do, and indeed the schools and the way they're trying to cater and accept and look after children. But your record is abysmal. It's a, one of absurd failure and neglect. And you're passing legislation here, Maria, that your uh, equality for this, equality for that. Where's the equality with these people being mistreated and being neglected and being abandoned, that their parents have to scrounge and, and beg and, and, and uh, implore and try and get their children uh, assessed and try and get their children, uh, you know, if they get an assessment, and have to put money together themselves to get a private assessment? It's appalling. Thank you, Deputy. And it's appalling. And you should have, have your head in shame at a government like you that would be in a time of so-called a first world country. It's not in short of a national disgrace and you should be get out of office as quick as you can and let somebody that can do it, have interest in the sick children, our special needs children do it. Thank you.